So, Namaste guys. In this video, we are going to learn how to make this part in sheet metal. Okay. So, this tutorial is for beginners. So, I hope this will be helpful for you. So, let's start. So, I find this CAD file basically on a Solvers group on Facebook. Okay. So, I'm trying to make this. Okay. So, while looking at this, uh, what do you think will be the best approach to make this? Okay. You can use this one, this one, or this one. But I will tell you why some views are bad. For example, if I choose this one, you can see 108 mm. But you see, this is a fillet. So I don't know exactly where to make it. Okay. Now, so I don't use going to use this method. Uh, first, creating this space as a. So I will not going to use this one. Now, second one, uh, some beginners will try this one. But the problem is where you will draw the band lines. Bend line basically those lines basically where you will bend the part okay so here you can see that you can't able to figure out where will be the bend lines okay i tried to make this one first uh, by making this approach first top uh, top view approach but again uh, this one will not work for me uh, who knows some better will find because i don't know exactly at what distance i will draw a line okay uh, for this circular uh, for this roundness so that is the reason i'm not using this one so i will start making from this view it is quite easy to use and make it so let's see how to approach this so first go here select the front plane and click on sketch i am using mmgs units you can use as per your requirement so draw the line as i'm showing so this length is 60 this length is 70 and this total length is 108 so 108 this is 108 divided by 2 and let's give it fillet of 6 mm and click ok and oh, ok after that we have to give some extrusion so the total extrusion is 70 mm and the thickness is 6 mm so let's start so how will i approach this go to the features extrude pore space i know some will, people will say hey man it is a sheet metal tutorial don't worry i will go later onwards so enter the value of extrude to 70 mm make sure that you select mid plane because it is an advantage of using mirroring and other parts okay and in thickness we will use 6 mm here you see the thickness is 6 mm and now click ok after that we have we got some part like this now we have to make this uh, make this thing so let's see how to pose this uh, so before i start making let's convert it into a sheet metal so go to the sheet metal just in case if sheet metal is not showing what you need to do is go to the any tab that is showing and simply right click on it now go to the tabs and select the sheet metal okay if you are not able to see sheet metal here it means that you doesn't install it uh, while installing solvers okay now click on sheet metal now first select this body and click on convert to sheet metal when you click on it make sure that you click on Collect all bands. After that, move downwards and there's nothing else and click OK. So as you can see, my whole body is converted into sheet metal. Now select this face and click on sketch. And we will draw making these circles and holes. So let's see, it is 25, 40, 6, and 35. So 25, 8. Six. So let's do the dimension 25, 40, 6, and this from top is 35. Uh, you can close verify here. Uh, here you can see it is from bottom 35, but you can also see it is from top, it is also 35. Okay, and press escape, select this point, and by pressing the close, select this point make it vertical select this line click on for construction go here click on circular sketch pattern select the center uh, this point 
select this click ok after that i have to make some roughness here escape and give it a radius of 35 mm okay escape select this line and select this make it tangent okay as you can see it converted to black line it means it is fully defined now what you have to do is draw the line as i'm showing and click on mirror entities select the lines as i'm showing uh, just go here and select this one and mirror about this line click ok after that go to the features and click on extrude cut you can also use sheet metal extrude cut as well the reason i'm telling just to know that you have a particular idea now select the uh, faces as per a requirement just in case if you are not able to select correctly make sure that you click on selected counters and select the faces that you want to remove after selecting them uh, give them a radius as per a requirement or oh, sorry depth of cut in my case 10 mm is sufficient and click ok so this is how it looks like now now we will make this one so let's see what are its dimensions 6 10 10 25 select this face click on sketch for a photo circle center line six ten so that this edge and this edge ten so like this and this twenty five six escape select this point and this point make it vertical after that go here draw a cone rectangle uh, let's see this dimension 15 by 35 so let's make it 15 7.5 and sorry escape Let's make it zero and draw a circle here. After that, click on mirror entities, here selection, select this and select this line. Click OK. Now go to the features, click on extrude cut. Click OK. Now select this face, click on sketch. And now we will make these things. So go here and click on state slot. Twenty. Twenty. Press escape, select this point and this point, make it horizontal. One and it's done. It's horizontal and select this line and make it horizontal as well. Okay, and I need to define the radius of it. So the radius is 6. 6. Okay, after that, uh, we have left with this one. Okay, now after making this i will use mirror command okay so 35 10 so let's see how to approach this so i will draw a circle here press escape select this point and this point sorry select this point and this point make it vertical and type 70 just you know here the radius is given so the diameter is 70 okay 
after that i need to select this point so what i can do click on point and select this so simply draw this now go here and select this and enter the value of 10 okay now what we need to do is simply we are going to now mirror select this one so first go to the mirror select this entity mirror about this line click ok similarly go to the mirror entities select this sketch and click here oh sorry i need to create a line mirror about select this line go to the mirror entities select this by the way we can also use this line uh, i doesn't I, I was forget for a second but here you can use this and click ok after that go to the features or you can go to the sheet metal and click on extrude cut click ok now select this face and click on flatten so this is how it looks like our part so i hope you learned something from this video if you have any kind of doubts and queries feel free to ask okay so thanks for watching and have a great day namaste